Hunter Woodhall triumphs in Paralympic sprint, joining wife as a gold medalist. In a momentous victory, Hunter Woodhall from the United States clinched the gold medal in the men's 400m T62 final at the 2024 Paralympics in Paris. The double amputee, running on prosthetic blades, crossed the finish line in 46.36 seconds at the Stade de France on September 6. His victory came just a month after his wife, Tara Davis Woodhall, won an Olympic gold medal in the long jump, creating a unique dual gold medal household. Davis Woodhall had made headlines during the Olympics when she rushed into the stands to embrace her husband in a heartwarming viral moment. This time, the roles were reversed, with Hunter emerging victorious and joining his wife in the elite group of gold medalists. Woodhall's triumph was not without its challenges. Just a year ago, he was unable to compete at the Para World Championships due to malfunctioning prosthetics. Reflecting on his journey, Woodhall said, This feels like a fever dream. I've gone through so much stress and worry to achieve this. When I crossed the line, I couldn't believe it, I thought I was still dreaming. In the race, Woodhall edged out Germany's Johannes Floors, who took silver with a time of 46.90 seconds, and the Netherlands' Oliver Hendricks, who secured bronze at 46.91 seconds. Woodhall also earned a bronze medal in the 4x100 Universal Relay, adding to his medal count at the Games. Kami G breaks Dutch stranglehold in wheelchair tennis. Japan's Yui Kami G made history by sweeping the women's wheelchair tennis competition at the Paris Paralympics, defeating reigning champion Didi de Groot of the Netherlands in a thrilling final. Kami G overcame a one set deficit to win 4 to 6, 6 to 3, 6 to 4, ending the Dutch dominance in women's wheelchair tennis, which had been unbroken since the sport joined the Paralympics in 1992. The day before, Kami G had already won her first gold medal in the doubles event, partnering with Minami Tanaka to defeat De Groot and Aniek Van Koot. Reflecting on her success, Kami G said, I can't describe how big this is. After the doubles, I still wasn't satisfied, I had to focus on the singles. De Groot, the defending champion, was visibly disappointed, I'm just really sad that I couldn't get the gold, she said. The expectations were high, but I couldn't live up to them this time.